the darkness, Martin! I will break you and leave you brain dead. You can't! You can come back to the light! I will find you! Okay? Did they take it? Yes. How worried should I be? Very. You're a popular guy. Where is the serum? I'm gone. The Discoya! So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. You really need two of those? <laughs> Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'll remember this. Tell me you've got a lead on Martin Lee's location. We have footage from a guy at a coffee shop. Looks like he hopped into a black sedan after the crash. Black sedan, great. Let me finish. We have a partial plate. And one of my patrol guys just found a matching plate. Black sedan in a parking lot near Canal and Hudson. You're a good cop, Yuri. I'm on my way. Spider-Man. Hello? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an Arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, he can kiss re-election goodbye. Oh, never mind re-election. He'd be tried in The Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Completely. But these actions have been a wake-up call. We've ignored the project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes. Doc left word. Park. Devil's breath is gone. I should call MJ and Warner. This is Mary Jane Watson. Please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. What are you up to now, MJ?